Hello everyone, this is Tormuz, and today I'm going to be picking up where I left off in the long dark. I feel like it's a bear. Um, yeah, where did we leave off? Oh yeah, we were, uh, I was just wandering in, uh, uh, looking for survivors of the crash who may have wandered off before this blizzard comes. Let's we'll see how this goes. Um, I actually just uh, I just did a stream a few hours ago of the, the that latest episode of um, uh, Our Castle Walls and uh, my sleep schedule is so messed up. I, I, I intended to sleep after that. I lay in bed for a while, couldn't sleep, so I figured what the hell, just just get up and play some long dark, I guess. <laughs> so here I am. Um. There we go, okay. Ah, okay. Back over here. Uh, the inventory is nearly full. I, I've got, okay. The number of um, flare shells could be a problem because I, I have to have four to get that other mission objective. Uh, there were a couple that I left behind elsewhere. Uh, I'm, I'm probably going to have to... Uh, just hope I can find them. Because the little helpful hint thingy said that I should... Um, before this goes out, how much water have I got? Got a liter. That's, that should be fine. Oh. Um, maybe I should take some time to cook this? I'm all full up on food, though. Um, no, I'm gonna I'm gonna, I'm gonna carry the venison over and use it for mission objective stuff. Whatever. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna move on. Oh yeah, just the old old bedroll. Okay, all right. Um, how's the temperature? Feels like 23, huh? Ah, okay. So. There's, uh, some person, some survivor over there somewhere. Um, am I going the right way? Somewhere in this big direction. Yeah, so the, the game gave the direction, oh, fire off a flare and see if there's a response. Um, I'm, I'm reluctant to do that because I've got four flare shells left and uh, I need four in order to meet the mission objective. Um, I, I know there are a couple that I... Um, I left lying around somewhere. I, I I do like I do remember there were there were a couple that I found that I just left there. It was in, they were in one of the cabins or something. I think uh, I don't remember exactly. But uh, oh, some of a jerk. Coming for me? Am I coming for you? Oh, great. Fun time to reload. Great. Hold still, guys. These are so annoying. Why can't you hold still? Maybe I should just run and uh, at least move somewhere where they can only come at me from one direction or something. Theoretically. Ooh, one shot, one kill. Or something like that. Woo, free meat. Sort of. Oh, this is going to take a while. 
Uh, it takes three hours to harvest everything. Uh, I should probably start a fire before doing that. Um, mm, <sighs> I'm, I'm all warmed up already, so it's not the best time to start a fire. I don't know. Whatever. Let's you know, just, just start removing it anyway. See how much it see how much this freezes me. Oh, it goes down to one hour and forty two minutes by when I switch to the hunting knife. Or five hours if I just I just rip the meat off the bone by hand, I guess. <laughs> yeah, an hour and forty two minutes is a lot more manageable in terms of time. There you go. Hey, look, I got sprain immunity. I mean, it says sprain risk, but it's really sprain immunity because I've, I've never actually had a sprain when I had the sprain risk affliction. Hmm? Oh. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Am I pushing the wrong button here? There we go. There is someone I'm supposed to be rescuing around here. They would make a lot of sense to be looking during the day, when it's lighter. Maybe I should fire off a flare-out, uh, like, the, like the thing directed me to. But I'm, I'm kind of tempted to... Um, Carrying all this stuff. <sighs> if I'm gonna fire off this flare, is it better to do it during the day or like do it right now during the night? Okay, you know what? Um, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna save it. Uh, like I don't want to be playing the the, the save scumming game, but um, like I don't know if this game is gonna is gonna provide me with uh, extra flares. So So what does it mean, look for a response? What response am I supposed to be looking for? Oh, really? Okay. Someone else has their own flare gun? Could that mean that maybe I'm, uh... have potential to, um... get more flares from them? to cycle through them is a bit of a nuisance. Starting to feel numb. So I'm guessing that's the flare that I'm seeing burning there. They don't have like their own fire or anything like that, right? If this is another person that I have to carry back, then, uh... Can I pick it up? It's gonna burn me if I try to pick it up. Oh, hey! Somebody has a fire. Is that, like, an Infinifier, maybe? Easy. I'm here now. <gasps> Piles of flares. Excellent. I'm taking all your flares. <laughs> I'm pretending to rescue you, but actually I'm just here to steal all your flares. What's that? Is that like a can of food or something? Painkillers. I think I can use this. Is that a bandage? 
weighed 48%. No, how about, what about the fire? Yeah, it's an infinifier, nice. Diagnose. Hmm. I'll see if I can help. <clears throat> oh. Dehydration risk, okay. I can give you some water. Sure I can. There. That should be better. Uh, let's get some more water going. Let's get a couple of these going. Do you have anything to say or No, my only options are diagnose and carry. And you're all warmed up, so yeah, so you you should be healing over time. Um, okay, in the meantime, um, how is my clothing doing? It's, it's, it said torn clothing when the, the wolf attacked me here. Oh yeah, I didn't, ch I didn't check if I had any other afflictions. Okay, yeah. No bleeding wounds. I'm fine. But don't take it, don't take it off. Ugh, come on. Oh, these aren't in good shape. I was gonna say. <laughs> uh, that, I get that feeling like I'm, I'm gonna sneeze and then I don't. <laughs> uh, I don't like the looks of these shoes. It takes an hour to repair them, darn it. Um, okay, well. Is there anything else I can do to pass the time while I wait for those? Trying to be efficient and get, here, prepare some ratio mushrooms. There you go. By the time I do that, the uh, water should be all ready. I think. Three, well, three more minutes. Uh, okay. Um. Ah, getting tired here. Um, it's probably. What's, what are the most efficient foods, are, or the least efficient foods? Are? Oh yeah, I started eating this one before and then. Since it's still kind of dark out, uh, maybe I should. Uh... Yeah. All right. Here's the plan. Cause I'm still kind of tired. Um, let's get some um, let's get some herbal tea going. Uh, let's camp here for a few hours just to get well rested and get daylight going, and then I'm gonna carry this guy. <sighs> I guess I'm gonna be carrying him all the way back. Maybe I can... <laughs> I'm assuming I can only carry one person at a time, so there's probably no point in... Uh... Probably no point in um... stopping at the other one on the way. So let's just set bedroll down next to the fire. Okay, what? Why am I hearing that coming out the left speaker when they're on my right, or when, when he's on my right? Like my thirst here. And get some rest for six hours? Is that enough to. because it's not super tired.
Okay, it's pretty well rested. Weight's at 78% now. Cool. Oh, wait, what? Is that a thing? Oh, no, it's just... So it looks like... I think that's just a can of uh, orange pop there. It's a bloody bandage. Okay. Anyway. Um... Give you some more water. You'll feel better after you sleep. And um, you know, let's let's take the time. Since I'm by a fire here, let us. Uh, yeah, let's repair up these shoes. I don't want to be caught without footwear. There you go. I don't have the leather to continue repairing, but at least it's, if I can get, if, as long as I can get all my clothing about 50%, uh, I'm, I'm content with that. Um, let's get, no, 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 we're not cooking the meat. The meat is going to the, uh, going to the folks at the, the community center. Uh, I'm cooking some coffee. And how much water we got left? Ooh, 0.17. Uh, yeah, we need more we need more water. Uh, honestly, um, you know, what the hell? Let's, let's eat an MRE. Because these are, um... Like in terms of relative efficiency, <clears throat> like these are more efficient than it. These are more efficient. Um, this one has 55%. Thing. I, I I probably should eat the ones which have the lower percentages first, you know? Because if it goes bad, apparently bad stuff happens to me. So even though this is a really efficient one, it's at 33%. I'm I'm gonna eat this. It's gonna dry me out like crazy, isn't it? And let's drink the coffee. I'll give me a little more water. Should I get more water going? I should probably I should probably get a lot of water around, quite frankly, because um, it's not just me that my old companion here. Uh, <clears throat> the, they, they seem to consume a lot of water as well. <clears throat> yeah, it's at 38%. I've got the other crackers as, as backup, so this is fine. Just eat these up. So as soon as this is finished boiling, then we'll get going. How's Wade doing? No afflictions. You're all right. You're all right. I'm all right. We're all all right. Um, it's daylight. Well rested. All warmed up. Good state to be uh, hanging, carry, <laughs> carrying an unconscious body back to the community center. Here we go. You're ninety percent. Good for you. Up now, easy. <laughs> so yeah, during the last episode, I was lamenting the fact that like carrying Gwen back was kind of tedious because it's 
such a long distance to go, and you can't run. Like, this this game already kind of has an issue of... You have to travel long expanses where there's nothing happening. Um, and, I mean, I, I guess that's, that's just sort of, I don't know, part of the deal of the game. It's... Uh, you know, you're alone in the wilderness, and you're, uh... It, it's supposed to feel like it's, you know, this big, open, empty world. Um... Sorry, where am I... What am I looking at here? What's this? What is this? This isn't on the map. Ah. I wasn't carrying so much junk, I'd probably uh, have an easier time with how much... Like, 7 kilos op over my weight limit. Bo even before I factor in... Factor in the... Uh, carrying a guy over my shoulder here. <sighs> anyway. Um... Is, is there, hey, seriously though, is there stuff I can just toss here and like come back for later? And the answer is, uh, I kind of want to carry all of this. Oh, okay. There's some, some sticks I can probably. Okay, the sticks I can probably drop most of, if not all of here. I'll just drop all but three of them. So, you know, there's a, there's a, almost a kilogram, uh, saved. Like, this, this rifle is super heavy. Add an extra four kilograms. I don't know. <clears throat> is that any faster? <laughs> they drop those sticks. Wade's voice continually coming out of the left speaker when he's clearly on my right. I don't understand. Uh, how they got it consistently exactly backwards. <clears throat> anyway, but yeah, getting back to what I was saying, like, when um, having to carry Gwen all the way all that way was, was already kind of tedious, a apparently. I have to do this three more times. <clears throat> just, uh, I, I feel like I, I should probably try to come up with some commentary to to fill this in. Fill in the empty space here, because this is just uh, it's going to be a whole lot of me just just sitting here holding my finger on the forward arrow key. And it's you know it's all foggy, so I, I can't even really appreciate the scenery. I mean, okay, I mean, seeing the trees come out of the fog is kind kind of neat, I guess. Looks like a fall that's greater than two, greater than two centimeters. So this could be a problem. Stay with me. This could be a problem. That's fine. Stop by Molly's house. Wonder, wonder, maybe I can, maybe I can leave him in Molly's house just you know while I run ahead 
and drop off the meat. Ah, great. I got you. All right. I'm just gonna. Gently, no. <laughs> Where are you guys? I hear you. There you are. <laughs> I'm a jerk. You hold still. Okay, fine. You get the flare. Maybe I should, like, let them go after Way just so that I, uh, so that they'll hold still for a few seconds. Of blood in oh, okay. Whoops. <laughs> Guess we should reload. <clears throat> Was fr those first two shots with the rifle were pretty good. <sighs> when was the last time it saved? Oh, great. Oh, is this before? Uh, great. Extra bonus. So not only do I uh, have to have the uh, the tedium of uh, all this, having to travel all this way, but uh, while walking, but uh, I got to do it over again. <clears throat> More than two centimeters. I got you. Oh. Stay with me. I'm okay. Don't fall asleep. Stay with me. How's your path finding? It sounds like you're on the other side of that barrier. Maybe I should leave. Like, seriously, maybe I should use weight as bait. Ah, darn it. Jerk. Wolf jerk. That's the way to do it. Sort of, maybe. Did you really have to load each fill individually like that? You couldn't have.
Sometimes she puts in multiple walls at a time. So uh, it looks like Wade took a bit of a pounding there. That was uh, suboptimal. Hey, buddy, how's your pathfinding? Are you having difficulty negotiating this boundary here? Points are almost at the bottom. Oh, it's zero percent. Waves are above boss. Oh, that's considered a game over too. Oh dear. Okay. <laughs> Maybe using him as bait wasn't as an optimal strategy. Or I just need to be quicker on the draw. Like seriously, like most. Uh... I miss fr frustratingly frequent. Ah. Frustratingly frequently. Okay, what if, what if I climb up here? You know, again, like just try to control the direction that the wolves can come at me. Maybe? I don't know. The wolves didn't come at me until I went down there, so... Yeah, you know, I don't think, like, I don't think the wolves approaching is, like, based on how much time has passed or anything like that. I think, I think it is based on, like, what area I've, uh... Oh, this is interesting. Is this negotiable? Is this, um... <laughs> Maybe this is a... A way to escape the wolves. If I can leave him up here, that would be interesting. an idea. It'd be kind of funny. show up any second now, right? It's entirely possible that wolves are specifically placed here. Oh, that's interesting. The wolves didn't show up this time, and I suspect it's because I'm not... He I'm not heading straight towards Molly's house. I think they're specifically there to guard Molly's house. It's a bit of a nuisance, isn't it? <sighs> should I should I head towards it again? Probably a mistake. Let's see what happens. Close am I? We can make it. Ah, damn it. You're safe now. <laughs> 
Damn it. three times before it fired. Was she just like like finishing up a previous animation or something and then and couldn't fire or what? What was, what was that? Did it again. That's part of the problem here is it's, it's not it's not firing when I fire. <laughs> like I push the buttons and The other problem is that they seem to be able to bite me from 10 feet away. <laughs> some help. <sighs> Let me have a look, okay? This, this time he wasn't touched. Should be better. Like he's fine. I'm in bad shape. I used up way more ammo than I, I feel comfortable doing in this circumstance. Like arguably that was the best run of it that I've had so far. I'm still tempted to reload just because so how many damn bullets I fired off. Plus, you know, the, the waste of the shit. The Flares, and it's just... Um, excuse you. You don't have a morale bar, you're not allowed to attack me. That's how this works, isn't it? I'm not tolerating them destroying my shoes. <clears throat> I liked my previous strategy better. <laughs> this rock here and uh, get to the other She's side. What are those crows interested in? They weren't flying directly, like they they looked like they were traveling somewhere. I won't let you go. Uh oh. So 
that look like more two, more than two centimeters to you? <laughs> that joke never gets old. Um, hell, maybe I should just avoid Molly's barn altogether. Like if I wasn't carrying this guy, I could just run for it. But I can't. I can't just abandon him. So, I mean, maybe I can. Well, actually, no. I demonstrably can't because uh, I lost. I lost the game when he died. So. We're making good time. Mama. I'm just gonna set you down. I won't leave you behind. Just dash out, get the wolf's attention, and dash back. Him or not? Wade, you suck as bait. <laughs> I'm trying to lead my target here, and they, they keep changing directions, and it's. Stop the bleeding before it gets worse. Also, the. So, because of the limitations of my processor, it's a animation's a little choppy. this time. I'm probably doing this all wrong. <sighs> okay, yeah, again, anyway, you should just say screw this and just avoid Molly's barn altogether. Or Molly's house, whatever. Come back for it when it, I have. It looks according to the map. There's a there's a another bridge this way. Like I still think it's a neat idea to. Uh, you know, maybe use use them to uh, draw them out, and um, well, I mean, I don't know. Right 
here. There's a heck of a shot. Go for him or not? How are you doing, buddy? You all right? Any wolves eating you? But why the heck not? You're the easy target. Oh, that was all right, I guess. How are you doing? You're at ninety-four percent. Were you at ninety-eight percent? Easy. Or? Just gonna see if I can help. Yeah, you're fine. I've done what I can. <laughs> Maybe I'll save it. Oh yeah, um, hold on. <laughs> Put you down again for a moment. You're safe now. <coughs> I'm here. Yep, the, never, like, I never found uh, the ability to make use of these in the previous game in, um, I mean, you know, in Mackenzie's episodes. Maybe I'll find use of them this time around. I have no idea how it works. Okay. It says they can be used for okay. the, the case can be used for crafting your ammunition. But, uh, so hey, if that's if that's an option, then I probably want to collect as many as I can. I don't know what the other components of making new ammunition in, uh, are. So I keep my options open. Maybe I'll even find Molly in, in her in her house. She seems to be all over the place. I mean, like she she made a remark that it's the the phones are a party line, so she just dials it and all the phones ring at once, and she just waits for someone to pick up. Like, okay, fine. That's as a. Kind of works as an excuse for why she's able to keep calling us all the time, but then she goes and says that um, she saw Astrid go uh, and rescue someone from the plane crash. Is like, how could you possibly know about that? that that's like, do, what, do, you, do you have your, uh, a network of spy drones or satellites or something? <laughs> like, how could you? see her go over there. That doesn't make any sense. I don't know. Let's just, uh, let's just head in here and uh, warm up a bit. 
don't know why else I can been to, to Molly's place. Don't give up. I won't. We're making good time. I don't think I can go in the front door, can I? It's locked, right? Yeah. Stay with me. It's this. It's a generator. You got a little fire pit here? Hey, is there some, uh, yeah, there's some stuff to burn there. I believe these are the cellar doors that I came out of in the first place. Warming up. <laughs> I'll just sit you down next to the dead guy. No, I'm kidding. Um, Just, uh, <laughs> I'm just gonna carry you upstairs so I can sit you next to the fire. Oh! Okay. I can't go back in. Is it trying to lay him against the wall? Anyway, just Here you go. set him down for a moment. Um, don't, I just walked over and didn't I? Um, I don't think there's anything that I can collect or... I mean, I can break the... Uh, I can break stuff down. Like, at least it, he's warmer here, you can warm up, warm up a bit. Um, I'm tempted to run back just so I can drop stuff off, so that when I uh, pick him up again... Because um, he, he's... I just... I gave him water, he's hydrated. I'm sort of wondering if I can run back, drop off the meat and stuff. Maybe we can even pick up the Joplin's bunker thingy on the way. Just so I'm not carrying so much junk. Uh. Or, you know what? Even better idea. Um, why don't I? Okay, there's no, there's no, um, there's no container. Actually, there's a container right here. You can hold up to 15 kilos. Okay. There. I am no longer burdened. I will come back for the meat. <laughs> And, uh, this is cured. How was that cured? Oh yeah, that's, that's the stuff that I uh, picked up from the other place, I remember now. Oops. It's fresh, 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 fresh. That should get rid of the stink lines, right? I will come back for these. They're all at 1%. Oh, that one's at 80%. Yeah, because these are, these are all... Um, this way I, I uh, lessens the number of wolves coming at me, and I can pick them up again when I, uh, I'm not carrying a person. I think this should help me have a much easier time getting back home. Let me have a look, okay? Yeah. 
I think, it, I think it's, yeah, it's fine. Easy does it. Okay. So there you go. So, so yeah, so I'll come back for that meet. It's all good. Is there anything over here? It's a ladder. Looks like a door, but I don't think there's actually anything there. I won't let you go. Hmm. Is there anything here? It's just ordinary stone, it's okay. I suck. So I saw crows flying around, and they, they might be flying over the body of one of the wolves that I shot. So I got a couple of good shots in there on them. Eh. But I, sh I should probably... I should probably press on. Let's just get back to the community center. Not waste too much time looking for uh, looking for wolf corpses which I might not be able to find. Scenery, though. I mean, now that the fog is cleared, like, you can appreciate. Best and... Oh, that was grim. Um, you can appreciate the art style. It's kind of cool. Like, I like how, how the art we style, how the art style uh, carries between the like the landscape, like the mountains in the distance, the trees, the clouds. Kind of cool. It's a sort of vaguely like painted kind of look to it. Okay, so there's some crows flying over there, and he's getting kind of cold. So I'm probably gonna have to start a fire soon. So, so maybe if, if there's like if there's a dead wolf or, or even if it's a dead deer or something, I, I can uh, maybe. Stay with me. Start to fly over there and, you know, multitask, warm up while harvesting stuff from the corpse. Pretty sure I checked out this car already. The, the hood's open, that tells me. Yeah, the, the, the visors are open too. That's one that I checked out already. around a little to the right of the the path here is that one of the wolves I shot well then might as well get something from oh wait is that a wolf what is that I don't think that's a wolf He's a guy that I searched already. Damn crows led me astray. What's this? Little piece of cloth. This is familiar. I think I, I think I followed that before. Okay, let's not get distracted. Let's uh, not get distracted. I say, and then it, and then I go. Oh wait, but the the bunker thingy is over here. He's got a, 
knife sticking out of the side? Yikes. You know what? I, I am going to go back to the bunker, um, just because it's probably a place I can warm up a little bit. Don't close your eyes. I mean, if they know. <laughs> she says as she goes in the opposite direction. Uh, yeah, if I'd known those uh, crows were flying over a corpse I'd already seen before, then I wouldn't have bothered with that detour. Oh well. Alright, where's this bunker? Apparently it's over here. Which means that I, I passed right by it on my uh, on my way over here the first time around. My family. Like, is it like an actual bunk? I won't leave. An actual bunker like the other one was? seeing anything here. Like, I'm right on top of it, according to this. Well, to my right. I'm looking right at it. According to the map, I'm looking right at it. According to the map, it's... Or the map, it's right here. Don't see anything. Everything on fire. Oh. Wait, is that it? There it is. Somehow she's gonna open the hatch with both hands while holding a guy over her shoulder. Astrid's incredible. <laughs> I can feel my face again. Stress pistol. So it's 100% condition. Nice. Kind of more interested in the flare shells, though. Now that I know that they're uh, decent at deterring wolves. Excellent. More rifle this ammunition. Stuff will come in handy. shells, nice. Hope nobody needs this anymore. I'm just gonna leave it. Uh, okay, these ones, these ones are nice. Um, I'll, I'll, I'll take that, I guess. It'll be a backup. I can leave behind somewhere. I haven't seen any of that in a while. Ah, uh, great. I just... Yeah, I'll take the book, I guess. Oh, look at all this junk. I mean... 
all this useful stuff. <laughs> I wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Holy moly, there's a lot of food here. Journal part two. Note found in the bunker near three strikes. All these quakes are a sign. Old worlds coming down around me. Gotta be on the move. Can't stay still. Gotta get away. Gotta get up higher. Someplace in the open sky, past the timber line. Way up. And presumably that uh, it's accompanied by a map and they're gonna it's gonna I'm gonna get a a third objective to go to, yeah. So much food. This game just so absolutely buries you with food. Is that another a go energy drink? Are these crates worth breaking up? There's no stove in here. I can't start a fire. Uh. What's the state of my clothing? Six, seventy-three, eighty-eight, ninety-seven, ninety-five, eighty-nine, sixty-five, ninety-six, ninety-seven, eighty-one. Eighty-one, ninety-two, what's this one here? Eighty-eight. It is point two degrees warmer. There you go. Eighty percent, eighty-one percent, eighty-two percent, okay. The clothing's all in good shape. Oh, this this energy bar is at eleven percent. Peanut is at twelve percent. You know what? The ones that are at that low percentage, because, because the um, the uh, the meat that made me sick in the previous episode was at twenty five percent. So I have a feeling I should avoid eating anything that's below twenty five percent. Um, let's eat MRE. Provides a bit of water as well, doesn't it? No. Okay, oh, there's a tiny bit of water. A bit of water for me, and how are you doing for water? Easy. Just gonna see if I can help. Give you a bit of water too. Feeling better now? I mean, while I'm here, okay, more water. While I'm here, might as well sleep for a few hours, I guess. But before I do that, let's see if there's anything in these. You want to see if there's anything in these crates? I can break them down by hand. Um, what the hell? Bring them down by hand to help pass time. Um, helps pass time. Oh, hey! Extra bullets. There's nothing in the crates, but still got something useful, so it's all good. Oh, here we go. Book of Legends, the big one. Book of Legends, but local pawn in this strange aquatic residence. Children playing along pensive pond know him as Big Eddie. He'd eat every bit of bread, meat, or other foodstuffs they would toss into the water, hoping to lure the massive fish to the surface. Of course, being children, their fascination with the creature meant they could spend hours along the banks of the pond waiting for him to appear. Others in the valley, being a more restrained disposition, felt obliged to leave the fish in peace. We can say what the truth of the story might be. So I'm guessing this is going to be another objective. Yeah. Pets upon and bring some fishing tackle. Okay. 
that's just that's just the burning kind of bug. Okay. Nothing else in here. What's the state? What's the state of the pistol that I've got? The flare pistol. It's at eighty-four percent. Well, why don't I unload it, drop it, and then pick up the one that's uh, hundred percent? There you go. And make sure it is loaded. <laughs> and uh, Astrid's skilled at loading it in the dark, apparently. And yeah, so let's just sleep for a few hours. It's warm here. He should be warming up, albeit slowly. Like, what, what is the temperature in here, anyway? Yeah, it's fine. Um, no. I just, not the papers. Trying to sleep in the bed. Uh, wait, how, how tired am I? Let's see, four hours? Make sure I'm well rested before, uh, before heading out again. Oh, now we're both dehydrated. There you are. Where'd you go? Yeah, diagnose you in the dark. Wait, it's temperature reading. I've done like, what I can. Like, okay, next to the the water meter is the three arrows going down, which means that it is getting more and more dehydrated. But the temperature one has an air going up, which means this temperature should be going up. But it's like not really. Let's finish eating this thing. Uh, um. Well, you know what? I'd rather eat these warm, but um. Whatever. They provide a bit of a bit of water as well as nourishment. because uh, I need the water water for uh, for giving to um, what's his name? Um, now I'm well over the forty kilograms again. Uh, is there stuff I can drop? There's probably lots of stuff I can drop. Oh yeah, the <laughs> reclaimed wood. Um, let's drop it all. I've got the fir firewood and the cedar firewood and piles of coal uh, to get me by, plus the books. And I'll probably drop a couple of those too. Like, uh, like this jerry cans full of stuff is bringing me down. Um, uh, all the food is weighing me down. Look at all this stuff. Uh, at least now I'm only two kilos over. So, you know, that's an improvement, I guess. This is half a kilo. I'm just going to drop it. It'd be nice if I could get myself below 40 kilos. Cares about the go any drink energy drink. I'm not. I'm not going to use that. We've got so many, uh, so much junk. Ah, so much freaking junk. Um. Whatever. Um. So just auto save. Hey, that's a good idea. Why don't I? 
overwrite my save and uh, let's press on. Yeah, Wade did not warm up at all in those four hours, which is a little annoying. So I'm gonna have to start a fire soon. Um, and I'll, when I start burning stuff, I, uh, yeah, I probably should pick up, a, just bring a couple of those. Where are you, Wade? Where are you, Wade? Don't make me use up the lantern just to find you. There you are. Here. Hmm. I'll see if I can help. Should have just picked him up. Why did I bother doing that? The only. Go. Now, unless it reoriented me, the exit should be right in front of me. Ah, damn it. It reoriented me, didn't it? Oh, great, I can't see a bloody thing. We're making good time. <laughs> okay, I can't, I can't see it. I won't leave you behind. I can't see anything. Ah, get this light back on. Oh, neat, I put him on the bed. Okay, so it's over there. is there, so if I rotate here and then go forward, let's file the cabin. Crap. Okay, back up. A little to the left. There you go. Okay. So this is deadly enduring storms. They also freeze and damage your clothing? Oh, they damage your clothing. Well, that's good to know. since he, like, refuses to dress for the weather. <laughs> Damn neurotypical people not dressing for the weather and... <laughs> I don't know, I just, uh... Some people, I guess, uh, they, like, they just... They value looking nice over being comfortable. for that as a result. Um, where's the bridge? Am I, am I under the bridge? Did, did I misjudge? Yeah, I am under the bridge. Ah, hope I can get up the other side with, without too much trouble. Plus side, this uh, this seems like a decent place to start a fire Easy. and uh, warm up. Like I'm fine, but uh, Wade's not in the greatest shape here. I oh, guess we're having a book burn fire. here. And we're gonna warm up quickly, so I, I mean, I'm gonna throw a piece of coal on there just so we to warm up quickly, because that, uh...
puts off the most heat. How are you doing there? Is that warming up? Cool. How am I doing for uh, uh, water supplies? I'll probably do with some more. Can I can I heat that up? The the opened can. Am I unable to uh, to heat up the open one? It says cold here. No, I, I only have four, and four of them display there, just didn't display as open. There you go. And on the other side, I'll just heat up some water. Well, melt some snow. Anything I can, else I can do to pass the time? Is it anything that needs, nothing needs patching up, right? I, I just checked it not too long ago. I mean, the shoes could do some patching up, but I need leather for that, and I don't have a source of leather at present. Nom nom nom. All done. Got the warming up benefit, even though I don't really need it. Drop the extra can. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Okay, so dropped off a little bit of stuff. Still a kilo over, but whatever. Um, it's okay. It's okay. Yeah, let's get going. Well rested, all warmed up, got the warming up benefit. All full, got a good supply of uh, water and food. Now we're back on the path. Much farther now. Here we go, back on the road again. I got you. Good. I won't let you go. Good wings. No way out. Kind of funny, you know, between Mackenzie and Astrid. Like Mackenzie is is a is a big burly looking guy, and 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 yet Astrid is the one who has to carry multiple people <laughs> over long stretches of distance. Hang on, <clears throat> she's uh, she, I guess she's stronger than she looks. <laughs> Me. How are we doing? Uh, yeah, it's gonna be a while. Yeah, we can make it. Uh, yeah, and now this time we don't even get the benefit of uh, the nice scenery. We're just walking through this endless, very samey, all, all dark. You can't see a damn thing. Um, like, like, see, this, this, this gameplay here is kind of boring. I mean, I should probably cut this out, really. Um, but hey, you know what? Um, maybe, maybe this will be watched by people from the dev team, and uh, they can look at this and go, "Huh, this is kind of boring. <laughs> this is." Uninteresting gameplay. Um, maybe we should design around that somehow. You know? Don't give up. I won't leave. 
Like, it was is already bad enough having to do it once. Having to do it four times is like, uh, you know, it's it's kind of like um, it's the same with with uh, you know the, that that bit with Mackenzie and the bear, uh, and, and like I made a comment that. Uh, Wow, they really like that bear mauling animation because they, they use a lot. Like they use y you, <laughs> like you can't get through that sequence without uh, watching that bear animation no less than eleven times. Eleven times. Like three times for each of the towers, and once when. Um, when, when he's, uh... It, have I checked this one? Can I, can I check the car while, uh... Stay with me. The, the, the flap's down, so I, I, I've checked that one. Never mind. Um... Like, that's just excessive. You know, 11... Going through that bear animation 11 times. Yeah, like, three times for each of the three towers, and then once when you're trying to enter the cave, uh, enter the, the tunnel, and then one more time when you finally kill the bear. Like, that's kind of ridiculous. Like, if you want to have... have uh, Mackenzie face the bear at each of the towers, okay, fine. You know, it's an excuse to have the bear be a recurring presence to give you, uh, give the player the impression that yes, this bear is, is stalking him or something. Um, that's fine. You don't need to go through that bear attack animation three times for each of the towers. That's excessive. Um, like, doing it once for each would be plenty. It might even still be excessive, really. Um, contemplation bridge. Where am I? Yeah, okay. Hey, I'm uh, making good progress. <clears throat> I'm passing by another another survivor, but um, yeah, come back for them. Are there are there any? Are there any beds? Left. Stay Fine. with me. I hope, I hope there's. I hope there's a bed left when I get there. Uh, anyway, um, like, I mean, anyway, I guess what I'm saying is like, like, the, the animation for the bear and all that. It, it, it's it's cool and all. I, I you know I don't blame you for being pleased with it and wanting to show it off. Um, you know, animation's hard. Art is hard. Um, but if you overuse it, if you overdo it, then it becomes less special. Um, you know, like after you, like I as the player, after I've seen it five, six, seven, eight times. It it just gets silly. Um, it's just it just gets tedious. It's it, it's it's not special anymore. It's just like like oh they're just they're doing the bear mauling animation again. <laughs> you know. Yeah, at this point, I'm close enough. Uh, yeah, I'm close enough to Kamisa. I'm not gonna bother starting another fire. I'm just gonna push through and go all the way there. Yeah, um, I guess if I, if I was to sum up my complaints about the, I, I, you know, I don't want to say my, my criticism is to be all negative, like, it, 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 this game has good points, like, the, um, like, the, the, the story is intriguing, like, the setup of the characters yeah. at the beginning is, is interesting, um, the art style is cool, um, 
it, it's got it does have some nifty game mechanics. Um, you know the, the whole crafting and survival thing. That's all well and good. It's all cool. Stay with me. <sighs> Criticisms I have. I mean, the big one right from episode one was lack of tutorial, and it just yeah, lack of tutorial coupled with totally non-intuitive controls like push four to start fire really uh, oh I see the fire the bonfire outside the community center in the distance there we're almost there hang on I have we're gonna be fine these hit points are gonna take down a bit oh well Uh, but yeah, let you go. Uh, <laughs> it's your fault for not warming up in the bunker when you had the chance. Yeah, um, but yeah, the, like the lack of uh, intuitive, intuitive controls uh, and uh, uh, tutorial being is the big one. Um, I think the pacing of the story could be improved a great deal. Um, you know, throw the like throw your audience some bones in terms of like what's going on with this mystery. Um, all right, here we go. So there's that, and then yeah, then the excessive use of the bear mulling animation, and and this this excessive just in time carrying carrying people around and stuff. Oh, hey. Was that there before? That was not there before. I swear it wasn't there before. Okay, seriously, is there, is there a bed for this guy? Oh, hey. Was that bed there, that bed there before? Rotate. Put his head on the pillow. Still hilarious. He just was, just throws him down. <laughs> uh, has Father Thomas got anything to say? It's the white up thing again. The storm is coming, and the people are vulnerable. Don't delay, my child. Yeah. Okay. Same dialogue as before. Okay, yeah, just curious. Where do you know? There's a fresh distress business. Been here a while. Like seriously, did, did I just miss this before or something? Well, why don't I take their their distress pistol and then just transfer it straight in here. Kind of hilarious. Okay. We're doing some inventory management uh, and getting a bit rested up. Uh, the black bear hide is only 84% cured. That takes a long time to cure it anyway. Um, yeah, I guess I'm ready to set, head out again. How, how long has this recording been? Uh, hour 48. Um, uh, that's fine. I checked all this out, right? I mean, the fact that there was a, like, a distress pistol kit just sitting there kind of makes me paranoid. Is there anything else that I, uh, these all say empty. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about it. Okay, what's next on my agenda here? Um, <clears throat> I, uh, oh, you know what, I should actually get more water. Um, more IRL water. Hold on a moment. Should have done that while I was doing my inventory management. Oh well. Anyway. Yeah, what's next in my agenda here? 
no wolves coming, right? Um, oh yeah. Hmm. Yeah, I have to catch the magic fish. This is the Jotlin's bunker is right here. Very close. Um, you know what? I might as well get that first. Because it's right here. And then, um... <clears throat> I'm guessing there isn't... I, I'm not expecting there to be a fourth. I, th I think I seem to recall there was mention that there was, there was there were three of them. So I think this is the last one. But on the off chance that it leads me to uh, some other one to search, uh, it's probably best for me to get it first because then I know where it is, so I know where to look. Because it would be annoying to go out there and then come back later and discover, oh, there was one that was right there that I missed and I have to make an extra trip. <laughs> so I might as well search this bunker now. Because I'm here, it's here. Oh yeah, additional fun fact. I, I'm over 30 kilograms uh, worth of weight here. You know, if I didn't have these extra bonuses, uh, I don't know what I'd do. <laughs> Might have to leave the rifle behind. <clears throat> Why are you going so slowly? <laughs> Every time I ask that question, I, I that uh, line from uh, System Shock 2 comes back into my head. Uh, Why do you move so slowly? Do you think this is some kind of game? It is only through luck and my continuing forbearance that you are even alive. Now move. I don't know why that, that line sticks out of my head. For some reason it's memorable to me. Where is this bunker? You know, I think I wandered out this way before, but I, I couldn't get up this hill, so it's like... Okay. Is it up on top of that rock there? Do I have to circle around? How do I get up there? Okay, I thought this was going to be an easy, quick jaunt uh, before I go on to my next actual real mission. This is... Uh, already taken longer than I expected. <clears throat> There's old man's beer like in there. Uh, I'll grab that while I'm here. <clears throat> yeah, while I was um, rummaging around doing my uh, uh, inventory management and stuff, I, I found that I had several bottles of antiseptic sitting there, so I just said, screw it, just throw them in, straight into the, um, into the thing. Um, I, I now have, uh, I, I've gathered everything together. I, 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 put, I put all the jerry cans worth of stuff in there, too. Um, I have everything except the food and the firewood there. So, uh, so yeah. Um, I might just, I, I might just gather the remaining food and firewood I need. Here it is. Oh wow. bunnies over there. I don't have any rocks on me, do I? Any rocks around? Maybe yeah, just for old time's sake to see if I can collect a bunny. Those are sticks. Ah, whatever.
Mission completed. Drop this back grade. There you go. Look at up. Holy moly. Multiple MREs. Extra can opener. I'm gonna grab all of it. All these MREs, holy moly. Be useful. Another one. <sighs> Madness. Oh, and there's piles of fire logs too. Okay, yeah, these fire logs are like very clearly, obviously. This pack is getting too heavy to carry. I'm at fi over 51 kilos. Mackinac jacket. Holy freaking moly! This is this is the one that. Uh, Mucklocks. Manufactured boot inspired by the traditional hunter's footwear. Designed for mobility and warmth using leather and fur. You can stay warm and move quickly. I'll take it. Ear wrap. That's that rare thing which... Oh my gosh. This is... Lots of acceleration and fire strike. This is a freaking gold mine. Look at all this stuff. Additional flare shell. What else we got in here? Stack of papers, who cares? <laughs> uh, books for burning. Another oh, knife. Oh, lucky day. And, uh, we're gonna find another note in the crate. No. Light this up just to make sure I can yeah. make sure I'm not missing anything. There's seriously no uh, there's, the other crates had a note in them. I'm disappointed. I think I can use this. Finished making up a big pile of bandages and throwing them into ammunition too. Holy freaking moly! So these are only these are only the, the burning kinds of books, right? There aren't any. Uh... I'm picking them up just to make sure. Uh... I've got a hefty pile of flare shells now. Uh, the next wolf pack I uh, I run into, they're they're getting some. Uh, this stuff will come in handy. They're getting some flares in the face. Alone or ten kilos. 
And these are another three kilos. Let's some nourishment back into me here. While also getting rid of a quarter kilo each with each. This is 11%, so that's going straight into the into the thing. At least I'm below 50 kilos. Let's Let's go unload all the food. Um, I, I probably I, I was planning to go back to the other bunker. Yeah, I was planning to go back to the other bunker just so I can um, um, I can't tell which way I'm facing. Yeah, this, this is the way this is the way I want to go. I was planning to go to the other bunker where, not sorry, not the bunker, it was Molly's house where I, I left the, all those big piles of, of meat there. But maybe I'll just drop all the MREs into the into the supplies. Since, you know, whatever. Look at this steep slope. Look at this steep slope, and I'm and I'm ten kilograms over. So theoretically have uh, you know major sprain risk managed to make it down without any sprains like the, the way this game calculates sprain risk is wonky Get this mission objective all, all finished up. Let's drop all the food in there, and then we'll go back get those fire logs and uh, drop all those in there too. And I can get that done and over with, and then I can, I can just focus on the survivors. <coughs> She's moving a lot slower because she's so weighed down. I, I wasn't ex I wasn't expecting to get so loaded down so quickly. Oh well. It's fine. Just knocking down those mission objectives. It's all good. Once I, once I get this done, I might might be a uh, good time to just wrap up this recording. You know, I managed to save a dude, stave off some wolves, and uh, got enough supplies to. Uh, to bolster this uh, you know, living conditions over here. Fifteen, seven, seven this is probably like two hundred fifty, right? There you go. <laughs> the one, that one little can of pop put it, put it right at the sixty thousand mark. Uh, after piling in all those MREs, kept one MRE for myself. And I think I think I have another MRE in, in here as well. I got a few MREs in here. This like this series of this game just buries you in food. It's nuts. These mucklucks are pretty nice. I mean, they're even though they're less conditioned, they're warmer. 
and provide better wind resistance and rain resistance and they provide more protection. They don't have the, they have the same slowdown. They're heavier, they're three times as heavy. Yeah. But they're, uh, they seem like pretty seriously nice footwear. Ah, <sighs> need leather to repair them though. Alright, so, like I promised, heading out one more time to get the rest of the burnables. <laughs> uh, Annoyingly, there's a, there's a blizzard going on out there now. Um, I, should, I could probably drop off a lot of other stuff too. Um, considering when I'm uh, going out there just to pick up a whole bunch of stuff, which is fairly close by. Yeah, whatever. I'll, I'll, I'm, I'm, I'm sure I'll be fine. Uh, I, The sound of the like how cold is it? My sixty eight ah psh, it's nothing. <laughs> Mind you, I think part of that can be attributed to the uh the, the mucklucks that I'm wearing now and the Mackinac jacket as well. Um I, I, I was able to fix them up. It, it took it took leather to fix up the mucklucks. The uh, I, I broke down the uh, the uh, the steel toe work boots that I had uh, in reserve. I figure um, I figure I'll, I'll just I'll use the um, uh, like regular walking shoes that I've been using, those, those can be my backup, and uh, use the mucklucks as the main shoes for now, which means an extra kilogram that I'm carrying, um, but uh, eh. I don't know, I, I probably, like, temperature-wise, like, I'm doing okay lately. I. I, I should probably be trying to uh, tip the balance more in favor of uh, things that are lighter at this point compared to things that are uh, that warm me up. That's that's the trade-off in this game, typically. Like the um, the things that are uh, that warm me up more are heavier. So you can, uh, you know, endure the cold more, but you can't carry as much. Yeah. All right. against physical harm, whether it be falls or wildlife attacks. 
To, close to enough, but uh, are you going to need a few sticks to put me over the top? Oops. I turned in the wrong direction. That's how it was with the food. I was, like, almost there, and I needed uh, an extra 250 calories, and a single can of pop put me over the top, which I still find kind of funny. The temperature. Oh, now it feels like minus 30, does it? Despite the steep drop and despite being overburned, still didn't get a sprain. Because you only ever get sprains when you don't have a sprain risk. This game is consistent about that. Like, it's not even a joke anymore, it's just. like, objectively true. over there. Ah, somehow I this entirely. Okay. It's fine. At the point where my hit points are taken down from the cold. Just a curiosity. So there's a little plus sign there. I think the plus sign just means that I'm like, I have over 100% hit points or something like that. Oh, now, now the wind has calmed down. Oh, that's neat. When I walked by the fire, my, my temperature went positive for a second. <laughs> and then it went back into negative again. It's fine, I'm indoors now. Now I can heal up. Is that two point? It's only it's only two point two hours worth. Those are those are the best ones. Uh, I'm gonna need a lot more than this. Okay. And this case, so it's at eleven out of forty-eight. If I put one of these in, how much does that add? Didn't add anything. 
11.55. No. Transfer them all in there. I think it's just not updating the number, but if I close it and open it again. Okay. So, need a lot more burnables. These 10 sticks aren't going to cut it, I guess. Nineteen point five. Hey, that added a whole extra hour. That's not bad. Anyway, um, yeah, this, like I said, this seems like a good time to uh, good note to end on. Um, all that meat I left behind in the Molly's house is just. She's gonna come back to her house and be like, what's that smell? <laughs> this container is like, ah! <laughs> Big pile of wolf and deer meat. Oh well. Um. Yeah, uh, it's just... Oh yeah, isn't there still, uh... 28 and 29 percent? should eat these first. I was, about to, I was about to walk over to keep them up in the fire, but no, they're they're already cooked, so it's not gonna make me sick. Okay, good. Yeah, it worked out well. meters are mostly full here, so uh, I'll set to go out on another trip, and um, that the, the wind has even calmed down, so uh, this next next episode I'll be in good shape for, uh, I, I guess I'll head over here, do the fishing quest, and find this person, and then after that I'll find this other person. And then we can move on with the... Uh, Move on with the overall story, because I think that's... I've already uh, met all the other optional objectives and stuff. This is 3%. We need 3%. How many other... Uh, how many more things are there here? 3%? Really? Even though I filled all this stuff up? Oh, well. That's all the Molly stuff. That's all done with. What other objectives have I got? All in Star. Oh yeah, that's the aircraft. Got all that stuff. Four star guys fight collectibles, telling the local side of the story. I think it was telling the four star guys side of the story. Yeah, I haven't really found a whole lot in the way of. Hmm. I think the only way I'm going to find those is just by random searching and just looking all around and searching random houses that I come across. I, like, I've been doing that. This is, like, I found some of these that way. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. Just got to keep an eye out for opportunities, I guess. Yeah. Cool. All warmed up now. All set to head out on another adventure. But yeah, on that note, this is where I save Astrid POV. Yeah. So rescue to do, bought us some wolves, gathered all the supplies except for the um, except for the wood burning stuff. I'm gonna have to probably just gonna just, just 
break down some, some more crates and then throw big piles of uh, reclaimed wood into there. Um, that's probably what it's going to come down to. Or just put in massive piles of sticks. Putting seven, seven sticks it was the equivalent of one hour, so maybe that's all I have to do is just big, just uh, gather every stick that I can find. And that'll probably do it eventually. Um, yeah. That's, yeah, eh, I'll, I'll get there, I'll get there. Um, yeah, that's all I got. Um, until next time.